hanging out backstage at uh, the next big thing. Broken Records are having a vegan barbecue over that side. Urban Rye, you don't want to know what they're doing over there. We're hanging out with the, the sensible gentleman of, uh, of Figure 5. How are we getting on, lads? Good. They've actually, to uh, prepare for the gig tonight, you went to see the Day of the Earth stood, stood still, you know. No, you, you went for a walk. Uh, you guys, uh, a little quick cinema review of the, the Day of the Earth stood still? Terrible, man. I we all fell asleep for at least 15 minutes. It's great for you guys to be doing um, the next big thing. You're kind of invited guests tonight to come along. and um, well, the next big thing since 2004, so <laughs> we, we've won it more times than anybody else. The, the way I like to describe Figure 5 is like a lit firework. Aye. And at some stage it's just going to go off and be chaos and be bonfire night all over the place. Aye, we're doing it in retreat uh, tonight though. We're yeah. doing that at the beginning and then... Very <laughs> <laughs> um, it's been a good year this year, though. You guys uh, have been doing a lot of the festivals, doing lots of gigs, it's writing new songs. Up and down, man. It's been up and down. Some of it's been amazing. Some of it's been not so great. We've like all oh, working all the time, so we're all working at different times and that. You know what I mean? Obviously, times are tight. <laughs> um, so it's been, uh, it's been, it's been, in terms of the, 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 we've got some like 13 tunes that we've done since like October, November 2007. So it was like the tail end of that year and then all through 08 and then the next year. Yeah, motherfuckers! It's the only one! I've been riding a house causing trouble, causing trouble as usual. <laughs> yeah! I told you. I told you they were planning something. Uh, we knew it. <laughs> fucking getting serious now. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so I heard us on new tunes this year. And us, and, um, just totally different from what we had been the three years before that. Do you know what I mean? So. I find it funny when I come see Figure 5 because I think in my head it's almost like you are um, the blue, red, white target, you are quite mod, um, the way you start off and all that sort of stuff, but I mean, there's so much more to it now. I, well, I think we went through the whole thing that kind of like loads of bands even for the 60s did when they first got in. Even the first gig, couple of gigs we did, we were playing covers and then we got into the kind of mode scene, we played gigs in Italy and Sweden and all that and we got right into the 60s Gary thing, I listen to that constantly for the three years. But then it just moved on, like the way gets to the end of the decade, you know what I mean? You start wearing silly hats. <laughs> you, get, you get bored going to see, if you go to see, a lot of people come to see us, I mean, they come to see us for years, so they would get bored of us just doing the same thing as well. Yeah, we get bored of doing it, so. I mean, uh, seeing Shaq at Classic Grand was like a turnaround point, because I just, because I've seen one of my favourite bands, Shaq, but I've never seen them live that great, and then that night it was like brilliant. And a couple other bands in Glasgow as well, Rudiments and that as well. Or getting into the same kind of thing. You've gone quite, quite folk almost in some bits I, of your I'm song, right? Rootsy, Rootsy, Rootsy more like than folk. folk. Folks, a guy with acoustic guitar and a girl singing to me. Right. Do you know what I mean? Uh, but then it's more just kind of taking back, stripped down. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, I've got one word from seeing your sound check, which is uh, trumpets. Oh yes, I oh, have yes. uh -huh. fanfares, <laughs> bugles. I, we kind of started off just doing like kind of one tune or like cut a bit of tunes, but now it's like every time we do a new tune, it's like oh, I want to get some trumpet. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Bugles is next, man. Is it a permanent fixture in the band, or is it just for tonight? Or? Um, no, it's no, pretty it's much all the time now. I have recorded. Be, by the way. I was going to say you've got a girl on stage with you. I think probably the biggest thing we've done this year was the Albert Hall one. And uh, we got a string section, an all-female string section as well, man. That was brilliant. But, uh, Magic. That was surreal, man. That was better. Brilliant. Well, um, I know you guys have got to go on stage quite soon, so thanks very much for taking the time out to talk to us. We've been asking everybody, uh, just as a band, what your New Year's resolution as a band would be for 2009. Stay off the swally. <laughs> That's what ruins everything. <laughs> I don't believe it happening for a second, but good luck with that. Uh, good luck with the gig tonight, and thanks for uh, taking the time to talk to us. Shall we go and get Urban Ryan out? Come on!